Would you look at this? It's almost civilized. The hedges are nice. Doesn't look so bad this way. Kind of undulates the other way. Yeah. I just put our rock garden in a bucket. That's a snail. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I blew this off yesterday. It looks like I could use it again. Yeah, things are looking good. <laughs> you know what I'm thinking of doing with this? Power washing it today. Just to get the top clean. Get this cleaned up. So I've got to start to get that ready for paint again. Need another coat of primer. And then uh, we'll get moving on. Uh, paint fiberglass this. I'm going to close this in. Some other holes. Lots to do. Okay. Ah, don't show me. No! We're enjoying our patio. I don't think you'd hear the train that well here. It depends which way the wind coming. Yeah, it's coming from the southeast. Yeah. Or southwest, sorry. What a gorgeous day. And they said mm. it was going to rain. rain. Yeah, yeah I'm going to yeah, check. Yeah. Let's see if I can get another coat of paint on that stuff. Same setup as before. Can you tell it's purple? Can up here. Okay, let's put a thick coat on it contact. Oh shit, I didn't put my mask on. Contact. So here we are, we gave it another coat. It's gonna need another one, I can tell. But, uh, look a lot blacker. We'll give it one last coat after this dries. Let this dry for a little hour or so. Give it another one. See that hose? Power washer? See this hose warranty card? <laughs> It hasn't la it's lasted a year maybe. What's the date on this? Uh five twenty twenty. Hasn't lasted a year and the end of the hose is busted. I'm sending it back. This is eighty bucks. So it wants me to mail the portion of the hose. At least six inches. Because of the lockdown, I can't just pop out and buy an end for that hose. It's leaking between the brass threaded end and the crimped brass thing. Of course, that's where they always leak. It's a manufacturing cost savings there. Because people won't send things back for warranty, that's why. Okay, I gotta get the other hose. It's a contractor hose too that's lasted probably 15 years. Found another end. This is from another hose that we had. Perfect. It's even the right size. It's 5 8. Clamp's a little squirrely. Got it working. So I've just done the one kind of a along the top here. You ready, Jazz? Yeah. Okay, I need the car keys and my wallet. I drop her off with friends. It's loud because I, when I did the uh, bearings, I fixed a motor mount and that's moved the motor and uh, it's put stress on the exhaust system. I have the part that has to be replaced, I just haven't replaced it yet. Okay. One thing that would be great about being bald is when you're hot, you just open the window and your hair is going all over the place. Mm -hmm. Is it cheaper to be bald? Yeah. You don't have to pay for haircuts.
hair products? No hair products. Just soap. Just soap. Well, when you wash your face, you have to wash your head. Yeah. Why <laughs> stop here? Let's do the whole thing. Simple. I find that funny. <laughs> I don't know why. Purple. Yeah. One more coat. Much better. That's perfect. That is done. Just gonna leave it out there to dry. Hopefully the 30% chance of rain just scoots on by us. And uh, I'll keep checking the radar. It might, it might not. It's a 30% chance, right? Who knows? Okay, um, got this running. It works well. Got the broken hose going. I did have an end, so I put that on. Still gonna return that and ask for my money back because that's guaranteed for 10 years, that thing. That's a really cheap, cheap system they got here. See? This is a uh, hard brass. It's actually not brass. It's like a potted metal aluminum or something underneath it, or not, some type of alloy, brass coated. And then this actually looks like brass, but it's so thin. And uh, this part turns on this one. It's not the way it's supposed to be. I got a little carried away. Wash both cars. And no, I'm not gonna. Wipe the water spots off. Just leaving it. Good enough. Well, I am off to go get some food for supper. Decided to order out. And yeah, gonna have some fried chicken again. But unfortunately not from Rob's Wicked Chicken. Bob's closed on Sundays. So we're gonna go to Mary Brown's, which is uh, next best thing, I guess. Rob's used to be in Mary Brown's until he said, you know what, I don't need the franchise. And uh, start making his own stuff. So we'll see how we like Mary Brown's. I think it'll be nice. I like Mary Brown's chicken. Got my chicken. Uh, hankering for some fried chicken. This will surprise Jasmine. She doesn't know yet. Got my fan going. Brought the uh, bimini cover in here. It's done. That's as good as it's going to get. And that's as, uh, as far as I'm taking it. Uh, nice thing is now, if I need to touch it up, I can just grab a spray can. And psh, psh, done. Or I can use whatever. So I, I used a lot of paint. I'm really surprised at how much that thing sucked up. But hey, I guess it's fabric. It's supposed to be waterproof. It is now. <laughs> it's waterproof. For sure. Okay, I better go get the ladders. It's supposed to rain tonight, so I don't want the one ladder out there. The other one can be out there. It uh, goes in the boat. Well, I guess that's it. We got some dark clouds coming in. It's going to rain. Put the bimini in there. Taking the cushions in, scattered the chairs around the backyard. What do we got over here? Huh, partially clean sailboat. Ah, still need some work. I, uh, I only cleaned that top part. I didn't do all the way up, just the sides. So, uh, I don't know if it'll be tomorrow or the next day I get in there, but it'll be someday soon. 
get in and uh, start doing some repairs inside and ah geez there's a bunch of stuff wiring oh, there's my friend Noel that's not his real name thanks for watching click clicky things